Hey guys, hey everyone, how are y'all doing? It's your girl Twin D. Thank you so much for stopping by and thank you all for your support. Let's jump into your message, guys, and let's see what's going on with your divine masculine or your connection. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thine will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Alright guys, let's see what has been influencing your connection. Okay, Father God, what's going on with these masculines and feminines? What has been influencing their connections, please? There's a burden. There's something that's stopping your divine masculine from moving forward, even though that's what's in their heart. You have the Ten of Wands and the Knight of Cups. There's something that your person, like they, it's like they, they, they refuse to move towards or go towards that thing, whatever it is. You all know that there's a lot of different things here. Not just it's not it's not just a romantic situation all the time. There's stress. You know, there's their own insecurity, there's their own mind, but whatever it is, it's a burden on these divine masculines. And it's like, it's like I want to move away from this burden so badly. But it's like, I'm not at the point yet where I can safely walk away. So this burden is preventing your divine masculines from coming forward with that offer to you there's some kind of deception as well that's why your person is hard for them to move forward and nine of cups so it's all about them feeling fulfilled it's all about them feeling happy it's all about them being in that space where they can see all the beauty that's gonna happen and move towards it but like i said there's some sort of deception so this beauty this happiness this success that they're supposed to see five 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 they can't see it because there's something that's deceiving your divine masculine again whether it's their own thought or somebody else or something the death some of your divine masculines are going through a transformation right now and that's what's preventing them from moving forward to you because they are at the point where they are going through their transformation as much as you were going through yours now it's their time so it's this rebirth situation that's influencing the connection and it's in a positive way because whatever change they're gonna make it's going to allow them to break free from, from that trap. Yeah, from the trap, their mind. Eight of swords, eight of pentacles. So there's abundance, like I said, that these divine masculines are seeing. But it's like, I'm seeing all this abundance, all this prosperity, but I can't. I can't, I can't reach it. I can't reach it. It's like they're reaching out for something, but... It's so close, but yet so far. Your divine masculines have been putting in a lot of work in, into themselves. Hence this transformation. They've been putting in a lot of work. You have the star. They have been working on themselves. They have been learning to fulfill themselves. Fill their own cups. Make things work. Take lemons. Make lemonade. So it's like they realize that forcing the issue to just rush and get out of the situation that has been holding them down like it's not working. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. There's an Aries energy here that I'm getting. Three of Swords. This could be the very reason why they are not moving forward. Why they're refusing their whole, their whole um, soul, body is refusing to move forward. It's because they're feeling broken, heartbroken, saddened. 
That's why they got to learn to fill their own cups here. They got to learn to be happy on their own. Tell me more about this Ten of Wands here, about this burden that's influencing this connection. Tell me more about this burden, please. You have the Four of Swords and the Nine of Cups. Nine of Cups, guys. So like I said, they have to heal this part of them that is not fulfilled. They have to heal this part of them that, that makes them feel sad and unworthy and not good enough. They have to learn to fill their own cups. That's their major burden right now and that's what's keeping your connection from moving forward. Wow, the energies are just repeating, right? That's why they're trapped. That's why they're not moving. That's why your connection isn't going anywhere because they have not yet learned to fill their own cups. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. So they feel like it doesn't matter if they should move towards you or make you an offer. Like it's never going to work out because nothing has ever worked out in their life. Nothing has ever worked out. So now they're in this whole misery here. Turn their back on who they truly love because everything about them, they're, they're, it's empty, their cups, it's empty. Everything about them was just spilled, everything in their life. Nothing ever stood firm in their life. Queen of Wands, so they need to get that um, strength and courage. Wow. Okay, I can't. <laughs> the death. So they have to overcome that ego. I like, I, man, I tell you, I love these messages. They just flow into each other. They have to overcome their insecurities. They have to be reborn. They have to transform. They have to walk away from things that are keeping them stuck. Uh, family situation, lover's situation, you know, their own thoughts, their own mind. That's the only way they're going to have that sense of fulfillment, that joy. And that's the only way they're going to move away to return to true love they gotta transform oh my god the messages are just flying out two of pentacles that balance that they need to achieve releasing that ego releasing the insecurities so see they're stuck in one place divine feminine they want to move forward with that offer they want to come they know that the offer that they have for you will be stable but at the same time that deception that they are feeling oh it's never going to work out it's not going to happen look at what happened to your past situations they never work out so it's going to be the same so they're stuck they got stuck they got stuck they got stuck. They got stuck. <laughs> so your divine masculines, they have to work on their, their, their happiness, their true happiness. And their strength, like I've been saying. This is what's keeping them back. Their insecurities. The lack of strength. Them seeing their own um, strength within themselves. This person has to learn to transform whoever they are into the emperor that they are. That's the only way this that offer is going to come in. What about this Eight of Swords? Wheel of Fortune and the Star. Yeah. Once they get out of this Eight of Swords mental entrapment, keeping myself stuck energy, I can't see anything because I'm so heartbroken energy. <laughs> Then everything will start to flow the way it should. Then everything will start to go back to the way that it should. From the beginning then they'll be fulfilled then they'll be filling their own cups pouring in to themselves flowing out acknowledging God this is someone who is gonna leave everything behind see this person is naked they're open it's like I'm gonna give you my all I'm gonna show you everything about me I'm not gonna be holding back anymore this is me this is who I am I'm spiritually connected and I'm learning to love myself for who I am. This person. Let's see. The Four of Cups. They've been blocking everything and everyone out. Shutting out their heart because it was broken. Not wanting to expose it. Not wanting to show it. But this is what I like to see. 
the movement, the action. So once they get over this heartbreak, once they start to see themselves for who they truly are, they're heading towards you, the world, all these major arcanas. When these major arcanas come out, you know that whatever is happening here, it is destined to happen and you can't change them. Completing that cycle, learning to love themselves, this, th this is their battle, this is their struggle, that's their struggle. But they're going to overcome this very soon. Let, let me get you um, a message from um, your archangels. Give me a message for the divine masculines here to give them some strength because they need it. Give me a message for them, please. Creative writing, Archangel Gabriel. Make time to write down your thoughts in a journal or pen an article or book. So your Divine Masculine is here. This message for you. It's like you are to learn how to express yourself. That's the only way you will start to see yourself and love yourself for who you truly are. Express yourself is what I'm getting. Stop closing off yourself. Stop hiding who you truly are. Those who will love you for who you are, will love you. And then when you start doing that, then you will see the fake lovers in your life. The ones who only love you because of what you can give and don't love you because of who you are. All is well, masculines. Everything is happening exactly as it is supposed to. With hidden blessings, you will soon understand. That's why I told you guys that those major arcanas. Give me a message for the Divine Feminines, please. Chakra clearing, Archangel Metatron. Call upon me to clear and open your chakras using sacred geometric shapes. This is what's going to help you and your divine masculines to connect spiritually. That's the only way you guys will have that self-fulfillment and that self-joy when you are balanced, when you have that connection with God. For divine feminines. Angel Therapy, Archangel Raphael, give your cares and worries to us angels and allow us to take your burdens. And outdoor, Archangel Jophiel, go outside, get some fresh air and connect with nature to relieve stress and gain new creative ideas. So Divine Feminines, you're overcoming your difficulties. One, two, three. All you got to do is call upon God, call upon your angels, balance that energy so that they can help you and that in return will help your divine masculines to see who they truly are take care of yourselves everyone love you all let go and let god and i see you at your next message later y'all